During the Russian forces unprovoked and illegal invasion of Ukraine, the Russians' Ka-52 attack and reconnaissance helicopter has probably suffered the most losses out of the Russian helicopter assets. Although exact numbers lost are difficult to ascertain, the number commonly quoted using photo evidence online puts the number at 8. These aircraft have either been completely destroyed or damaged and then abandoned. As this footage shows, the Ka-52, referred to as the Alligator, continues to play a significant role in protecting Russian vehicle convoys, conducting search and destroy missions, and protecting airborne troops during helicopter transport landings from Ukrainian defenders. The Ka-52, shown in this section of footage, is conducting a dual role today. There is a Russian convoy moving along a road, and the Ka-52 parts are conducting reconnaissance sweeps for potential enemy positions. They are also tasked with attacking Ukrainian fortified strongholds around an airfield in an unspecified location. The Ka-52 are now on escort duty to protect Mi-24 and Mi-8 helicopters carrying Russian airborne troops to secure a Ukrainian airfield. Although the alligators are not seen much in this clip, they are being kept busy defending the helicopter landings from sustained Ukrainian fire. Russian helicopter pilots reported how about 15 enemy manpads were fired at the group of helicopters. And after firing off heat flares and performing counter missile maneuvers, they arranged into two formations and performed a fire carousel tactic by continuously engaging the enemy with small arms on missile weapons. The lead helicopter was hit by a Stinger man pad fired from a short distance. The pilot was able to steer away from a direct hit, with the missile exploding in the area of the tail boom, resulting in a control system malfunction and an instrument failure. The pilot was still able to fly through what he described as heavy fire from all directions by the Ukrainian armed forces. The Russian pilots claimed they had completely suppressed all identified enemy positions. However, while covering the landing, a Ka-52 was forced to make an emergency landing after being damaged, and their crew rescued by a Mi-24. A force of Ka-52 now conducts a hunt and destroy flight mission. The lead pilot, named as Mikhail, reported how they discovered an enemy stronghold, as well as armoured vehicles of the armed forces of Ukraine. Acting upon the discovery, the Russian pilots used guided and unguided missiles claiming the complete destruction of the Ukrainian infrastructure. In this final section, Ka-52 are purportedly shown attacking a command post of the Ukrainian armed forces. The target area was hit using multiple Vikhar anti-tank guided missiles. The destruction of the mills facility was carried out at a distance of over 7,000 metres without the Ka-52 pilots entering the Ukrainians air defence zone. This war goes on but with the imminent delivery of advanced surface-to-air missile systems to the Ukrainian forces, we may see a lot less Russian helicopter operations in the near future. <laughs>